you're taking large doses of methylene blue, it actually turns your brain blue. Okay, I'm gonna stop him there with the brain blue. So he's gonna go on to talk about how methylene blue can turn your brain blue. And he will quote you the right amounts. 300 to 500 milligrams of methylene blue in the IV may do this. Nobody should be taking this kind of a dose of methylene blue. The study that he quotes here as well and shows pictures of, which are quite shocking, I definitely agree with that, we're giving people upwards of those doses IV for acute septic shock, for cardiopulmonary arrest, and severe presentations where these patients were going to die, and in fact, many of them did die, even despite them trying to use these high doses of methylene blue. So clinically, again, in practice, we do not use these high doses of methylene blue unless it's in an emergency room and there's an emergency. Otherwise, the doses that we typically use, four milligrams, eight milligrams, 16, 25, maybe up to 50 milligrams, maybe slightly higher that for, sh for, for shorter periods of time. But in general, you will not be using these high doses. Your brain and your heart and other organs are not going to turn blue.